Hi, I'm Fred Andersky with Bendix, and I'm here today to talk to you about Volvo Active Driver Assist, a collision mitigation technology that's based on the Bendix Wingman Fusion system. So what makes Volvo Active Driver Assist unique? Well, instead of utilizing just one sensor, a radar sensor up front, we add to that a camera that's up in the windshield. Radar in front sees the metallic object, camera helps verify what it is, and that delivers an earlier read on the situation, which results in an earlier alert to you, the driver, and an earlier intervention, if necessary, to help mitigate that rear-end collision. Typically, with less false alerts, less false interventions. That's what makes Volvo Active Driver Assist different than radar-only technologies out on the market. Now, keep in mind that this is a driver assistance technology, not a driver replacement technology. So your safe driving practices, along with comprehensive driver training, are gonna help keep you safe on the road. But it's good to know that you've got Volvo Active Driver Assist backing you up. Volvo Active Driver Assist features following distance alerts that let you know when the gap between you and a forward vehicle is closing. Typically above 37 miles an hour, Volvo Active Driver Assist will give you three alerts, a close, closer, and closest alert. Below 37, we give two, a closer, closest alert. Here's our close alert. Our closer alert. our closest alert, and if we continue moving towards the vehicle, we'll get an impact alert and collision mitigation braking. A common scenario that we often see resulting in rear-end collisions is when traffic ahead of you slows down and you may be distracted for a second. With Volvo Active Driver Assist, the system will alert and, if necessary, cut throttle and deliver a brake intervention to help avoid the potential impact with the forward vehicle. Volvo Active Driver Assist also features adaptive cruise control. When cruise control is on and your speed is set, Volvo Active Driver Assist will help you maintain a safe following distance behind a forward vehicle. When that vehicle slows down, Volvo Active Driver Assist adapts to the situation, slowing you down to match the vehicle speed. Now, if that forward vehicle accelerates, Volvo Active Driver Assist will accelerate you up to match their speed or your cruise set speed, whichever is lower. If the vehicle cuts in front of you and accelerates away, Volvo Active Driver Assist doesn't consider it a threat and doesn't react. You may get a momentary distance alert, but as you can see, as the vehicle pulls away, we maintain our set speed. Now, if the vehicle cuts in front of you at a slower speed, the system will engage to help you maintain that following distance behind that forward vehicle. Because Volvo Active Driver Assist uses both a radar and a camera to deliver information to the system, we can deliver stationary vehicle braking. The radar sees the metallic object up front. The camera verifies that the object's a vehicle. We alert the driver with the impact alert and then we cut throttle and apply the brakes as necessary to help the driver mitigate the collision with the stationary vehicle. If the system can't identify the object in front of you as a vehicle, you'll get a stationary object alert that will give the driver an up to three second heads up, allowing them to slow or swerve to avoid. Keep in mind, because we build Volvo Active Driver Assist on Volvo Enhanced Stability Technology, driver always has the option to add additional braking or, if necessary, swerve to avoid the potential collision. 
Volvo Active Driver Assist also includes lane departure warning. So if you accidentally veer out of your lane six inches, you'll get an alert. If you use your turn signal to indicate your intent to make the lane change, the alert is suppressed. Sometimes when you're in a work zone, the lane markings are not very clear, which can sometimes lead to the lane departure warning delivering excessive alerts. By pressing this button, lane departure warning will be suspended for about 15 minutes or until you press the button again to turn it back on. Volvo Active Driver Assist also delivers alert prioritization. Say, for example, you accidentally slip out of your lane while a following distance alert is going. Alert prioritization means that Volvo Active Driver Assist will focus on the most important alert. In this case, the following distance alert. Volvo Active Driver Assist delivers speed sign recognition. Because the system has a camera, we can read the speed limit signs on the road and give the driver an alert if they're going faster than the posted speed limit. At five miles an hour over the posted speed limit, we give an alert. At 10 miles an hour over the speed limit, the driver gets an alert and a one second de-throttle. So please note that we do not apply the brakes with speed sign recognition. We're not trying to slow you back to the speed limit just giving you an alert to let you know you're speeding. If you have additional questions about the alerts or about the system, please refer to the operator's manual that came with your vehicle.